At the inauguration of the National Dialogue Advisory Committee, President Goodluck Jonathan tasked the committee to address critical national issues that tend to threaten the unity and integrity of the Nigerian state. The respondents while setting agenda for the committee outlined gray areas such as true federalism, equitable distribution of the nation's resources, separation of powers and constitutional reforms that need to be addressed in order to move the country forward. They also have on the issue of national security, pointing out that the deteriorating state of security in the country should not be treated with key glues. The respondents called on well-meaning Nigerians to cooperate with government in assuring the committee succeed in the task. Attitudinal problem and the constitutional legal problem, those are the things that I really uh, believe are the major problem we have. Against the background that we have really never had a, an, a, a, an authentic constitution in the real sense of the word, a constitution emanating from the people. The unity of the country, that's number one. The insecurity, this terrorism is not our culture. It's a good development and uh, all Nigeria are looking forward to this committee to provide a lot of solutions. The, the committee, per se, should look at the issues of derivation. They should uh, look tackle the issue of resource control. They should, above all things, the issue of the PHB, which has not been passed into bill, has not been passed into law, that will give more greater autonomy to the regions pro producing these resources, oil, and this issue of uh, pseudo-religious re restiveness in the north. The advisory committee who are expected to submit its report within one month have Dr. Femi Okuramu as chairman, Wellington Hakodeja reporting.